Hey, it's Yvonne here. Uh, today I just wanted to delve a little bit deeper into Click Magic uh, and integrate um, or make our own custom domain as we discussed in this video so that we can mask that nasty link, that nasty affiliate link uh, that we discussed. So the first thing we're going to do is we will go to Namecheap. Uh, dot com okay very good website they they sell you some extremely cheap domain names it's under a buck uh, worked perfectly well for me I have zero complaints about this site um, so when you go to Namecheap and I'll post the description down below uh, you know just type in www.namecheap.com uh, pick your domain so last video or not last video but in the video where we picked our Clickbank offer where you can see over here uh, where we made our landing page we picked diabetes so maybe we want our domain name to be something similar to diabetes, right? We don't want it to be bicycles.com and then talking about diabetes. So let's say, you know, let's say we're going to do diabetes.com. Let's see what that gives us. Most likely it's going to be taken uh, just because it's, you know, it's so simple and clean. And as you can see here, yeah, so diabetes.com is definitely taken. Diabetes.live, that's the next best thing, uh, all taken. So... Uh, I mean, you can buy this. You can try to find the buyer and buy it for twelve hundred bucks. Uh, but I don't know if you're willing to do that. Okay. Um, so same with everything else. I mean, the cheapest one here is Diabetes Inc. Uh, for nine bucks. But I don't know if you want to do that. Like, if you're just testing this out. Okay. So let's try something else. Maybe let's try DiabetesCure.com. Let's see what option that gives us. Okay. So this one's better. So you could do DiabetesCure.life for two forty-five. Um, and then here you have, yeah, so you don't have any any ones for 88 cents, or do you? Let's see. So we're going to go to 88 cents. Yeah, so so, so, so here you have some diabeteskewer.tray, diabeteskewer.webcam, okay? So it's 115 for me. I'm in Canada, but it's 88 cents for you Americans out there, okay? Uh, so obviously, you know, pick whatever you want. Uh, let's assume that you're going to take this one. You just click Add to Cart. You view cart, you pay. Okay, I'm not going to teach you how to pay. I, I, I hope you would know how to use your credit card by now. Um, if not, maybe I'll make another video <laughs> to show you guys just how to do that. Just kidding. But um, so when you do that, when you buy your domain, uh, just click on dashboard. Now I'm already logged in. Um, and then pick your new domain which you bought. So let's say it was marketing site, uh, marketing success dot site. Okay, for example, I'm cheap. I don't want to buy another domain for eighty eight cents. If I have to, I will absolutely. Um, in our future examples, uh, for now, I just want to show you kind of how to do this. So make sure first of all, you when you go to domain that it's Namecheap Basic DNS. Okay, so make sure it's set on here. Nothing else. Um, maybe we'll go over op other options later on. Uh, I mean, for example, for my effort for success site, I have custom DNS. That's for my blog. That's so that um, it links those two together. Okay, so that's not something we want to do here. So make sure it's on Namecheap Basic DNS. Go to Advanced DNS Settings, and okay. So you need to go into Host Records. Then okay, what you will have is you will probably have uh, something here at the top already. Uh, I don't remember what it's gonna say. Uh, and then you will have an, an, an empty slot. So just delete everything. Okay, let's start off with that. Delete everything that's there under host records. Uh, delete both of those things that you have there. So first thing you, you want to do then after you delete them, go into type URL record. Uh, so make sure it's URL redirect record, nothing else. Okay, just that. Under host, put down this at sign. Okay, shift two is your at, hopefully, if you have a normal keyboard. And then you have to put the value, okay? So this is that click magic um, kind of name that, that you have to put in here so that they're integrated together so that we can use our new domain on click magic as a custom domain. So we'll go into click magic, we'll go into help facts and type in, and I'll, I'll send you guys the final link down below so you don't have to go through all this, but I'll just show you if, if you wanna know the long way of doing it. Let's just say custom domain. So it gives you videos here. We don't want a video. You can watch them if you want to. Absolutely feel free. They're about 15 minutes long. Uh, but hopefully I can do this in a much shorter period of time. And you don't have to look as intensively for it. So here you want to find... So you know what? I'll just say set up a new domain. I'm just going to copy that. Because we don't want a video. We want that exact uh, link, right? So which the video won't show us because it's different for everyone. So click here. 
how do I set up custom domain? And then scroll down to the middle of the page. Uh, here, sorry, to the middle of the page. And then, like I said, it's different for everyone. So for me, my username is Ambition. I'm just going to copy this. I'll copy that link. And I will go back here. And I will paste that link here. I will click Masked. And I will click Save. And then I will do the same thing here. Exact same thing. I'm going to copy everything. The only difference between the two is that here I also put www. And that's in case people click or people say www, uh, clkmg, right? It, it, it ends up going to your website domain as well. So I'll click save as well. Um, yeah, so to add the second one, you need to put add new record, okay? Just that button over there. So that's it. So you're done for Namecheap part. You have your domain set up. You know, this is completely yours. Everything's good. So now we need to go back to Click Magic. Uh, you need to go to Tools, Domain Manager. And here you need to take your domain, copy it, right? Again, for example, it's marketing uh, success.site. Don't use this domain for or anything similar like that to diabetes. It's not going to match. Um, so whatever your new domain is with uh, diabetes, you want to put that in here. Um, so imagine this is diabetes.com, whatever. And then click so leave that as is, method one, tracking links, leave that as is, and say add custom domain. Now, I already have it here, so I'm not going to click add custom domain. But when you click the add custom domain button, it's going to just show up down there. It's going to say method one. That's perfect. That's where you want it to be. So it may take you some time. It may take uh, five minutes, may take a minute, may take half an hour or 24 hours. For me, for this one, it took like about an hour. I don't know why, um, but it works now, so it's all good, but it just took a bit longer than usual. So... Next thing we want to do is we want to create a link and make that custom domain available to us instead of the nasty one. So for example, over here, I've already set it up. Um, so I'll just delete this and I'll just show you. So let me just make sure that this is indeed our affiliate link. Okay, so this is our Hi, affiliate link. My name is Reba. Uh, that people click on to buy this product. So let me just save that and I will delete this. So for you, just starting off with ClickMagic, this is what it's going to look like for you when you go to links. So type create new link. You can make your own link group. So if you end up having many offers, you can, um, or many different links, you can separate them into groups, uh, which you do just by clicking here. Uh, it's very simple. Just, just follow the steps there. Uh, link name. So put in a link name, you know, let's say we want to do diabetes. This is about diabetes. Then when you do that in Namecheap, when you register your domain and when you um, use the domain manager and click magic, your new domain will be available here. So as, as you saw in last video here, where I just talked about what click magic is, um, this kind of is the default, which is not very good for, again, the two reasons we mentioned in this video. So your new link will be available in this case, you know, marketing uh, success .site. put in your affiliate link there. And we need to make an ID name. So this is just anything, uh, anything you want really. Like this won't be taken by anyone, but it's got to be between four and thirty-two characters. Um, so it's just an ID to kind of differentiate um, your site. Okay. So, well, well, it tells you all you need to know there. So let's say let's make it diabetes. Create link. Okay. So that was made up, and now look. So that's our new link. <clears throat> so compare this with this, much prettier, right? Especially if you have your own custom domain. So we'll click on copy, paste, and boom. So it takes us to the Hi, exact same affiliate link. So if people buy this, we still get credit for it. Nothing changes, just the prettiness of it. And again, um, like I mentioned in the previous video, um, it won't be blacklisted, okay? So I'll leave that. So that's it. Um, if you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, leave them down below. Um, please subscribe and stay tuned to the next videos where we'll delve deeper and integrate all these systems together and make them work for you. Thanks for watching.